Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. My name is Parker. So today I've got a really interesting video, something I've never done before, and that is ranking all of the Fortnite live events, all the way from the very first one up to the latest Doomsday event. So if you guys enjoyed today's video, be sure to drop a like down below and please click that subscribe button. Guys, I really cannot thank you all so much for the support lately. I only hit 800 a few weeks ago, and we just hit 900, guys, and we're already at like 906 right now. We're less than 100 away from the huge 1K, so if you could help me reach that goal by clicking subscribe, it would mean a lot. So without any further ado, let's rank some Fortnite live events. All right, guys, so I'm going to go through the whole list here. First of all, we've got Godly, Awesome, Good, All Right, Trash, and Never Again. Pretty straightforward, makes sense, not much explaining there. And now all of the events, so the very first one is actually from season three of Fortnite when the meteor started crashing on the map. It was technically like a mini event. It wasn't an official event, but that was like the first event in Fortnite. And then the second one is the rocket launch in season four. The third is the cube when it appeared on the map. And then when the cube exploded, the ice king event, the marshmallow concert, the unvaulting and volcano event. The monster versus robot event and then there's the the end event that happened in season x and then in the new chapter the star wars event travis scott concert and the latest the doomsday event all right so we're going to start at the very beginning of the list with the very first meteors crashing on the map in season three so this is a super og event i did witness this event in game it was pretty cool the only thing that happened was just a couple meteors hitting and destroying parts of the map, which included like Dusty Divot or Dusty Depot. I apologize. Dusty Divot happened after the rocket event. So this event wasn't really exciting. You know, it was, I'm going to put it under good because it was the very first event ever to happen. And you know, it wasn't godly. So yeah, we'll stick with good. All right. The second one, the rocket event. Oh my God. I'm just going to have to throw this under godly. This is like the first, I would say, official event. I don't know, like the, the previous one was more of like a teaser to this event, but this rocket event was by far probably my favorite event ever. It is just insane. Yeah, <laughs> I really wish I could experience that event again. Moving on, the cube. Okay, this event really confused me. Like, why a purple cube? So. You know, it was cool how it traveled around the map, leaving all the ruins. It was like a very long event, which is cool. I would say either good or all right. Um, oh God, let's put it under all right. Cause it was kind of confusing to me. Like why was the cube here? So yeah, we'll stick with all right. The next event when the cube exploded and caused like the islands to float or whatever in the middle. I mean, it was cool to be able to fly around that center island. I'd put it under all right also. Okay. <laughs> the Ice King event. <laughs> Never again. That was just quick. It was so boring. There was so much hype built up to this event. And it was really sad, honestly. He just blew snow over the whole map. That's it. Like, it was really boring. Don't want to see that ever again. So, yeah, that's we're going to put that one under Never again. The marshmallow concert so i miss this live but i watched it afterwards i'd say it was pretty good yeah we're gonna stick it either all right or good yeah we're gonna go good it was it was pretty cool i wish i did witness it in game but i was like out of town or something i don't remember but yeah pretty cool okay the unvaulting event slash the volcano event this event was pretty awesome i would say so you know we might put it under the awesome yeah, we're going to put it under awesome just because, you know, we could all go into the vault and choose a weapon or item to unvault, which is just pretty awesome because, you know, Fortnite usually makes all their own decisions. So this event was cool. And then the fact that it led straight into the volcano erupting, destroying Tilted. Amazing. So, yeah, this one's definitely going under awesome. All right. The monster versus robot event. Oh, this one was amazing. It was so well done. And it was just so thrilling to be there with this event. It's going to go under godly. Honestly, I was going to put it under awesome. But that event was just so entertaining and well done. The music, just everything about it was super cool. So yeah, I really did like that event. 
All right, the picture on this is kind of weird, but this is supposed to be the end event, basically in season X when, you know, the rockets and stuff happened and blew up and goodbye map. <laughs> um, <laughs> so this event, it was cool. It wasn't the best. I would put it under good because, you know, it destroyed the old map. You know what? Mm, we're going to put it under all right. I'd say all right. Yeah, it, it was cool, but it took away the old map. So that's why it's going under all right. Star Wars event. <sighs> yeah, it was pretty trash. Sorry. It was cool that, you know, the ships flew on the map and then we got lightsabers. But the actual event itself was just so bad because it was just this dude like commentating and it was not hyped whatsoever <laughs> so yeah it was a pretty bad event okay we got two more to go travis scott all right this event was freaking amazing it's going under awesome it was oh yeah it was just incredible how big this guy was on the map he was just an absolute giant and the fact that we got to experience this new song go through all these amazing looking worlds it, yeah it was just a really well done event super proud of that one so yeah good job epic all right the last event doomsday this just recently happened i'd say what was it like a month i don't even remember but this event is gonna go pretty close to the top of the list it was really well done with the whole build up it was a really long build up with all the vaults appearing around the agency with the whole story with Midas and everything, how it was, you know, Fortnite is a whole simulation. So yeah, everything about this event was really good. I'd go either awesome or godly. No, we're not gonna go godly. I think we're gonna go awesome. Yeah, okay. So that's pretty much it for all these live events. So let's quickly do a recap. So godly, of course, the rocket event. It was simple, but again, this was the very first event in Fortnite history and it was really entertaining to be able to be there in game so that's why it's in godly same with the monster event season 9 was an okay season definitely not my favorite but this event made it 10 times better so that's in godly also the unvaulting and volcano event really well done everything about it was awesome that's why it's an awesome same with Travis Scott really well done doomsday same thing good was basically the very first official or unofficial i i don't know it was, it was a mini event that i'm gonna call it the mini event because it was just a couple you know meteors hitting the map but it was the build-up to the godly event so that's why it's under good marshmallow event or the concert i should say really well done but the fact that you just stood at the stage the whole time kind of made it a little bit boring that's why the travis scott is above it so it was good the cube just didn't make sense to me and the end event was just, it sucked, kind of. I mean, it was cool, but it took away the map, so that's why it's on all right. Star Wars event, trash. I like Star Wars, don't get me wrong, but that event was not good. <laughs> and never again, Ice King, by far worst event in Fortnite history. So if you guys enjoyed today's video, be sure to drop a like down below and click subscribe and let me know if you want me to do any other tier list related to Fortnite. I know a lot of other YouTubers have done rating the different seasons. I don't know about skins, I'm pretty sure people have done skins, that would just take like an hour probably to do every single skin. Weapons that's been done before, so yeah, if you guys have any other ideas that haven't been done before, be sure to drop them in the comments. So again, thank you so much for all the support lately, it really means a lot, we're so close to 1k, and that is my dream on YouTube. I never thought I'd do it, but you guys are helping me out, so thank you so much.